Hey guys, welcome to Weekly Crypto. Today I'm going to show you how to install Icon Wallet for the token swap. Also, just to remind you guys, Haven Token Airdrop. So this is a stable coin similar to Tether. The project is based in Australia and the airdrop is limited to 50,000 participants. So if you're interested, uh, you can click the link below. Also, Coburn Hood, they are going to give some uh, give you some giveaway. So Coburn Hood is essentially a cryptocurrency exchange just like KuCoin or Binance, but in a smaller scale. And they don't charge any trading fee. And let's see, the giveaway is you have to do a survey, like three to five minute surveys, and then you can get 30 Coburn Hood coin. So I will put the link below as well if you're interested. And also, Symbios. Oh, before we get into that, uh, make sure you subscribe to my channel so you don't you don't miss out any upcoming airdrop, hard fork, and ICO. And for Symbios, I talked about Symbios wallet in my previous video, and I couldn't find the Shasham. Um, let's see, the Shasham. Uh, check some file, and EOS Real sent me the link. Uh, that I can find that. So after you download the wallet, you can still use a Shasham check. Make sure the in integrity of your file it has not been uh, tampered when you transfer uh, when you download from GitHub to your computer. So let's uh, before we talk about the wallet, uh, the EOS, the Icon wallet. Let's talk about the faults for EOS block producer. So here the website, uh, you can see the first block producer is Bit, uh, Bit, uh, Bit Finance EOS and over 3,000 voters and EOS Canada over 6,900, EOS Authority over 6,900, EOS Debt Server over 7,000 and this number 5 block producer like only 1,780 votes and number 10 block producer is uh, only have 595 votes. And also this block producer number 14 only have 290 votes. So EOS is based on delegated proof of stake, right? So the more uh, EOS token in your wallet, your votes will be weight more. So that's why it's not the number of voters, it's the weight of your wallet that counts. Another thing you can look into is this uh, EOS block producer vote summary. And you, you can see some of the wallet, uh, for example, some of the block producer, uh, one, two, three, 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 four, like four big wallet, uh, three big wallet folding for this block producer. And also, let's see, and also this block producer as well. See, this is a 1.2% of the folds. And here is a big wallet as well. So it seems like all this big wallet contribute to the votes uh, for this prop producer. You want this side, uh, as I mentioned earlier, we want this side to be bigger. When you look at EOS Canada, they have um, a lot of smaller voter, 0.79%, uh, EOS Authority, 0.82%, and also uh, EOS Debt Server, 0.87%. And EOS Gravity, EOS New York, EOS 42 Freedom, they have a lot of uh, smaller folders, EOS Can, uh, Canon as well, EOS Cafe, and also uh, EOS, uh, let's see, EOS Korea, EOS Korea, they have like 0.71% as well. So we'll see how it goes to fold. Uh, please comment below what do you think about this uh, folding process. So let's get back to the Icon Wallet. So right now we have to do a token swap. Let's see. So the token swap, um, because Icon is already migrated to, they have their own mainnet. So the ELC20 token, those on the Ethereum blockchain has to migrate, move it to the uh, ICX or Icon mainnet. So that's why you have a token swap. And we already passed the time for the token swap in the exchange. You can send it to the exchange for the token swap, but we already passed the time. So another method you can do the swap is to use 
is to download their Icon Wallet, uh, Icon EX, and you can swap the token inside the wallet. So the token swap will be starting from June, uh, June 25th to September 25th. So during this time, if you want to trade uh, the Icon token, you can only trade in Binance, Upbit, and Bitfarm because they support the Icon Magnet token. So you can't trade in other exchange. And let's see. So also for the token swap uh, submission, uh, because after you install the wallet, there's a button called swap. You can click the swap button, you can do the swap. So if the so if the token swap submission received before UTC 9 plus 9 will be processed and distributed on the same day at 1800, submission received after UTC plus 9 will be processed the next day and no distribution on weekend or holidays. <clears throat> so this is some um, so there's some message uh, talk about the swap mainnet ICX token will be stored in the icon. Uh, EX ICX uh, Icon X ICX wallet starting with a HX, not the Icon X Ethereum wallet, which is start with zero X. Also, please do not uh, don't send any Icon uh, wall, uh, mainnet coin to the Ethereum based wallet, such as my Eva wallet, because they are diff they are on different blockchain now, so they are not the Ethereum ERC twenty token um, those uh, token anymore. So ERC twenty ICX uh, token or icon token that are swapped will be burned and will be no longer be used. The burned ERC20 token will not be in total circulation among. So hardware wallet will support for mainnet ICX is under development, but we don't know the time frame yet. So, so let's go to the icon website and then you can click the wallet. Once you this is you need a Chrome browser in order for this uh, wallet to work. Because once you click the wallet, they will ask you to add to Chrome extension. So this is similar to MetaMask wallet or Jazz wallet, it's like a Chrome extension. So you have to use a Chrome browser to install this program. And I already installed it, so it's in here, so I click this one. And it will show the Icon X, uh, EX wallet. So I will go ahead and create a new wallet right now. So you will choose Ethereum uh, first. So which coin would you like to add Ethereum first? And then you go to the next. So wallet name, you can type anything you want. I would just uh, do a test right now. This is a testing wallet. I will type in a good password for this wallet. So go to next. Then you can uh, download the key store file, which is important in case you the computer crash, you can restore your icon wallet using the key store file. So I already downloaded it as a confirm, and then I go to next. And then you want to copy your private key. I'll go ahead and copy and put it in a text file in here. Uh, this is a testing file. Uh, so I'm not going to use this test wallet. Or you can also print the wallet as well. So you can also print the wallet. So they will tell you, uh, oops, so the private key and then the wallet, wallet address. Um, so uh, I can save it, you know, and all that. So I'm not going to save it at this time. I'm going to escape right now. So this is very similar to my Ether wallet. So, so I will complete this process right now. So right now we are uh, getting into the my uh, into the Icon wallet. So another procedure you have to do is you have to add the token. So you have to add the uh, the address. You can get it from this article, which is also in the. Medium article as well. So you copy the contract address and the token name is icon symbol ICX and decimal is 18. So let's get back to this. So let me copy the address and then I will type icon or oh, the ratio ICX here and then 18 you add the token. So 
let's see. So this is the Icon Wallet. So, so this is the, you can deposit the coin in here. And let's see, my page, oops. And this is the Ethereum. And here you can do the swap. So once you can uh, deposit the icon from your my Eva wallet to this address, and after you deposit it, you can do the swap. But right now the swap starting, uh, they will do the swap uh, transaction on June 25th. So just wait until June 25th until I think September 25th or something like that. So just wait until the time before you do the swap. So once you swap, uh, I think probably they will change it to X, X or something, the address of the icon. So let's get back to the wallet. So get back to wallet. And also you need some Ethereum into this wallet in order to do the swap because they're going to write a contract or something. So it will impose some gas. So just put a tiny amount of Ethereum there for the transaction to work. Also, you can back up your wallet as well. I hope I remember my password. Okay, and then you can uh, download the key store file and the private key as well. This is how you back up your wallet. And also, let's see. I think there's one more feature. Also, you can do a screen lock. You can put a six digit number. This is a digit number, it's not character. So you can just type in um, for the screen lock. In case you're somebody also using this computer, you can also uh, lock your screen, lock this wallet. So every time you sign, you get into icon, you have to put in this, uh, part, uh, this six digit number before you can get into your wallet. Otherwise, it will it will just let you get in without any uh, passcode. So you can activate this as well. At this time, I'm not going to activate, but this is an additional feature if you share a computer with people. But then if you share a computer with other people, I think you better to have a different login account for uh, in your computer. For example, Windows, you can set up another account for login. Also in Mac, you can do that as well. But just in case uh, <clears throat> you really want uh, to set a password, you can, so for example, if I click, uh, right now I'm already in it. So we will say SS my wallet, right? But if you put in, uh, if you put in a screen lock, if I click this, they will uh, ask you for the passcode before you can access to the wallet. I mean, this could uh, create extra security in case you walk away from your computer, stuff like that. And let's see. So we so right now uh, you can transfer your icon uh, ICX token to to here, and then you do the swap uh, on June twenty fifth. This is how you do it. And let's talk about. <clears throat> I think icon also has an app in Android. Let's see. Yeah, uh, not this one. I think, we, oh, oh, right here. So Icon also have an app in Android platform. Currently it's only 1,000 download. So I will wait a little bit before and see how this apps uh, work. So it's to see if any bugs and all that, I'll wait a little bit before I do the uh, Android app. And also they are, um, this is a project that's, that's going to be running on the Icon mainlet. So Carbonium is a de democratized social trading platform. Uh, they're going to do a crown sale on June 25th. And so you can check it out if you're interested. This is basically um, like trading. So it's like, it's like follow some people, how you trade and all that stuff like that. So, but this will be quite interesting because it's a trade like a pro and all that. But the thing is, 
you don't want to trade follow the masses, right? You don't want to follow the herds, right? So <clears throat> although it's an interesting project, I don't think you should uh, do your trading based on you know the consensus from from other individuals or whatever. You know this is I think they pull the so social trading on Carbonio platform allow any user to become a follower trader and then there's a lead trader. So I think you should use your due diligence before you do something like that. But anyway, they this. Uh, Dapps or Decentral Applications Carbonium is going to um, launch in launch on the uh, Icon platform. So it's it's good that they have something uh, pretty cool coming up. So let me know what you think about the upcoming Icon uh, token swap. So if your token is in the exchange, uh, in Binance, uh, Bitfarm, and I think Upbit. They already uh, so you, you're all set you don't have to do anything so also uh, regarding the EOS voting so let me know what you think about the voting and uh, all that thing also I think they talk about code uh, EOS code is uh, code is law is a myth and all that and there's a lot of controversial in the reddit community right now and also drop a comment below do you think code is law or you have to do like um, governance instead of code is law anyway so if you find this video helpful please make sure you subscribe to my channel uh, my channel also hit the like button as well this will help out my channel also please share the video with your friends uh, make sure you subscribe so you don't want to miss out the upcoming airdrop giveaway or ICO remember we the people take control of our money stay wise stay safe peace I'm not a financial advisor. Please use the due diligence to invest in your money. Investing in ICO has inherent risk. Use your due diligence. See you guys next time.